Well, here in May of 2013, I've been a pastor now for over 12 years. And I think in that time, one of the most important lessons I've learned has to do with the power of the preaching of the Word. And I think I learned that especially from my own experience. And this takes us back to the time when I had cancer and was being treated for it. It was a very powerful aspect of my experience then that the things that I'd heard from the pulpit, the preaching of the Word for so many years prior to that time, the Lord was very kind in getting those truths into my heart and mind in a way that was so valuable. And it strikes me to this day, looking back on it, that the Lord used the preaching of the Word, the steady, faithful preaching of the Word, week in and week out, to help me to grasp those truths in a way that was so important for me when I was sick. And that has stuck with me, because I think that's important both for preachers and for those who hear the gospel, that preachers need to understand that they ought to seek to be steady and faithful like that, week in and week out, even if nothing spectacular seems to be happening, something very valuable is happening, a whole reservoir of truth is being built up in people's lives. And I think it's also important for those who are hearing the preaching that they have long-term expectations for the preaching of the Word, that they're thinking about preaching as something that they're storing up really for the rest of their lives. Because a sermon might not blow you over in that moment on that Sunday morning, but store it away. Store away the truth that you're hearing because you have no idea what the doctor is going to tell you 10 years later. You have no idea where the Lord is going to take you in such a way that you need those truths. So I think that's one of the lessons about Christian ministry that I've tried to take with me from my own experience hearing preaching then into being a preacher myself.